Acting in haste may cost us dearly. It would serve us well to continue our investigation before taking action. I proudly serve as Regent Lord. What I'm about to share will be revealed to others in due time. Your discretion is of the utmost importance. The Eternal Sun still guides us. Never again shall a king... I greet you on behalf of Silvermoon. Aldiel Shalar. Though I despise her actions, I cannot deny that Sylvanas Windrunner is a master tactician. The scourge attacks and the abductions must be part of a larger strategy. The Alliance is every bit as wounded as the Horde. King Ren and Lady Proudmore were taken. They also came for Tyrande Whisperwind, but she neutralized her attackers. Really? I knew the Night Warrior's power had grown, but to dispatch an adversary that even Jaina Proudmore could not. It is fortunate that we have the Knights of the Ebonblade to aid us. General Nazgrim reports that Bolvar Fordragon is free of the Lich King's crown and is recovering in... What's more, the Argent Crusade has rallied to answer the call. They stand ready to drive back the scourge from our lands. Bolvar Fordragon was one of the bravest heroes Azeroth has ever known. If anyone can advise us how to defeat this menace and recover our friends, it is the High Lord. The legacy of the Lich King is forever entwined with that of my family. Regent Lord, though I serve only as an advisor to the Forsaken, I ask to stand with you as you face this threat. Your voice has offered wisdom to both the Forsaken and the Horde Council, Lady Menethil. Whatever comes, we will face it together. And I will reassure the Justicar. She has our full support. Our reinforcements will be arriving shortly. I am Forsaken. Beware, our enemies abound. Well, well, well. If it isn't Azeroth's mightiest champions. Congratulations.
You managed to track me to the most unlikely of places, my very own home. Seeking retribution for all the bad, bad things I've done, I suppose. How frightfully predictable. I have been waiting a long time for this. <laughs> Let's get on with it, shall we? Stand and face me, cowards! Back into the fray with you! My hounds will make a meal of your pitiful flesh! All this grows tiresome! Along with every soul burned to ash in your precious tree. Where is she? <laughs> Go on. Kill me. You'll send me right to my lady. Beyond the veil, she shattered. <laughs> oh, Tyrande. High priestess. Night warrior, completely powerless to stop the coming. stuff. Nice. Oops. Alliance horde. Pathetic, the lot of you. In life, Nathanos Maris was a braggart and a bully. In death, his worst traits were only magnified. At long last, the Blightcaller has met the justice he deserved. I only regret I was not there to see it done. I cannot begrudge to run the Whisperwind for claiming the killing blow. I only hope the Night Warrior's rage remains fixed upon Sylvanus. I do not wish to speak out of turn, Regent Lord. But I have given counsel to the Kaldori who were raised into undeath after the battle for Darkshore. I believe I have helped them find a path forward. Perhaps if I spoke of them to the High Priestess, it might help ease her spirit, if only a little. Lillian Voss has told us of your efforts, Lady Menethil. Let us hope fate offers us a chance to see your kind offer bear fruit.
it through the rift. Good. I doubt this mission could succeed without you. No sign yet of the High Priestess. Perhaps she charged ahead into the chaos. The Knights of the Elm Blade will not alter. Struggle all you like, mortals. You cannot escape your fate. The Alliance will endure. Very well. Where to begin? Denizens call this realm the Maw. From what I have gathered, it was intended as a prison for the most foul, irredeemable souls that ever existed. Something has changed. Pure, noble souls are being held captive here as well. They cry out in torment. Indeed. And one of their tormentors, and ours, is Sylvanas Windrunner. It seems she has made a powerful ally. The Shades whisper of someone called... The Jailer. Control your power. The Jailer rules this realm. We know little about him, but it's clear he has taken a special interest in us. He has personally overseen our treatment here. We have endured countless torments. At times, it felt as if we were being tested. Though, for what purpose, I cannot say. Whatever this Jailer and the Banshee are planning, it won't end well for any of us. A single spark. I caught glimpses of Bane and Anduin during my attempts to break free. They live. That's all I know for certain. But I have found no means of leaving the Maw. I can only manage to teleport short distances. This nightmare feels... inescapable. Countless souls are now pouring into this realm. Some have been here for untold ages. Perhaps one of them knows a way out. I can scarcely imagine the horror such spirits have endured. I fear there's nothing left of them to save. They manifest as malevolent shades that wander the darkness. I doubt they'd willingly help us. Knights of the Ebon Blade have ways to compel the dead to speak. If we seize one of them, we can extract its secrets. The true battle lies ahead. All is not lost. Not yet. A shadow of hope will <laughs> succeed. Such a narrow vision. You disappoint me. No matter. We will find what we seek. In another. Anduin! How badly are you hurt? I will live. I'm relieved you're all safe. These bonds are too strong to break by force. We must find a way to free him. wounds are mending, but his spirit remains weakened. I've never seen anything like it. I believe I have. In a place very far from here. From Ka. For Azeroth. Loktar. Together. Nothing escapes the law. Ye They've stopped their advance. The light is with me, even here. Go 
world champion. Go! An agent of the Maw is attacking Oribos! Defend the Arbiter! Hold. The Maw's power does linger upon them, but I sense... No, that cannot be possible! You are welcome here. We must bring them to the Overseers at once. Come with us. Stranger. The reports from our scryers were unmistakable. The Moor shuddered for a moment as if reacting to some change. An ill omen to be certain. What can it mean? Overseers, this stranger appeared at the city's edge. I believe them to be a living mortal. How may I aid you, mortal? Fate guides your hand. Another unexpected development. We shall see to their reception. The purpose brought you to us. We all have a part to play. Every attendant in Oribos is taught that the Maw is unbreachable. That the Malevolent souls within were sealed away for all eternity. This mortal's escape might mean the prison is weakening. If true, the banished one could. Cardelen! Karsher! Purpose be praised! At long last, the Arbiter has stirred. Wondrous news, honored voice. Mere moments ago, there was a disturbance at the boundary of the moor. Then this mortal appeared, claiming to have broken free of it. A living mortal? Surely their presence here serves the purpose. If the Arbiter reacted to their arrival, perhaps they are the key to waking her. Is this mortal worthy of such an audience? They may prove to be an agent of the Jailer. It is the Arbiter's place to judge souls, Kasher, not ours. I will bring this mortal before her. With her voice have I spoken. Blessed be her voice. Blessed be her voice. Hear the words of the Arbiter. I will consider your words. I pray the Arbiter will awaken in your presence, mortal. What might your purpose be? She is unchanged, ever silent. Ever still. When you arrived in Oribos, I saw the Arbiter stir for the first time in many cycles. It gave me hope that she would awaken and resume her blessed purpose. Mere words cannot describe the glory that was. Step forward, that I may show you. For uncounted eons, 
the Shadowlands was in perfect order. Infinite afterlives, with Oribos, the eternal city, as the shining heart. Every mortal soul came before the Arbiter, and she, ever wise, experienced all that had shaped a soul in life. With this knowledge, she consigned every soul to the afterlife it justly deserved. Until... Now souls rich with anima travel only to the Maw. We have tried everything to stop it, to awaken our blessed Arbiter, to no avail. Without anima, drought has gripped the Shadowlands. The afterlives have grown isolated. Fear and uncertainty haunt us all. With countless souls feeding the Jailer, I fear he may grow strong enough to break free from the Maw. It is said he is filled with hatred for the Arbiter. If he strikes her down, it would bring the end of everything the First Ones made. Return to the lower levels. The Overseers will prepare you for what is to come. With her voice... Oribost welcomes you. The Eternal City must endure. We stand together against the darkness. State your purpose. You arrived in Bastion with dire news, which I have shared with the Archon. She thanks you for your service. As a token of gratitude, she wishes to offer you a gift. Do you accept?
I would have you speak. Go in service. Go in service, aspirants. Archon's the eyes of upon Bastion you all. Is in our hands. The Archon said nothing of Kyrian serving the Maw? Perhaps she does not believe it. We have but the word of a single aspirant, though one would think that would be enough. Forsworn, the temple is ours. I know that voice. No, no, this cannot be. It is dire news, Persephone. But the Archon has turned a deaf ear to such tidings in the past. The circumstances have changed. Tell me of these forsworn. Most have merely lost faith and may yet be redeemed. But some have fallen so far as to wield the power of the Maw itself. It is true. This mortal has fought against Ascended who are in service of the Jailer. Lysonia is not the only one. We do not know when or where the forsworn will strike next. But strike they will. What you speak of is unthinkable, but we must remain vigilant nonetheless. Paragons, return to your temples. Adrestes, monitor the wards. It appears you have a part to play in all of this, mortal. Let us see what comes of it. Go in service. Sabotaged, as we agreed. Good. Our allies are eager to strike. The Kyrian temples will fall, and the Archon's reign shall be ended. Battle Necromancer, our courage never falters. It will take more than courage to save you now. My Paragon, you do not stand alone. Ah, just the vessel I require. The Archon for Bastion! Clash is about to begin! Nothing sweeter than the sound Only of Only two gladiators remain. One legend will grow, and the other will end.
always ready for battle. Our oh, enemies surround us. This is our Stay only path. Main... But clearly you are the only one meant to wield it. Go on, then. Looks like taking up the blade empowered one of its runes. Knowing the Primus, that's just the start of something more. Need something forged? Get going. Hold this ground! Our victory is at hand! We can't fight our way in. There's too many of them. This calls for a change of strategy. Play dead. If they think you're a lifeless husk, they'll collect you for parts. Go on. I'll create a diversion. Face me, traitors! The House of Constructs will fall! Capture that fool! Wait! I am not yet a corpse! The others, can you help me find them? ...to his doom. Master, our preparations are complete. We await your arrival. Finally, the power our new Baron promise shall now... No! The ritual! It is ruined! Methodist! No incompetent fool! It is you who are the fool, Morbitan. And your folly has brought your demise. Wicked spy! Curse you! And your fallen house! For Agarek! Always ready for battle. Slay the mortal! Bring me that rune blade! Raise your sword, champion! Form out Raxus!
Are you in need of the wild hunt? The forest. There are too many of them! Protect the horn at all costs! to my grove. Night embrace you. Be gentle. She's oh, almost gone. This should be interesting. We'll meet again. I once said that your voice is but one bird singing in the night. Well, I think it's time we all sang with you. I will protect Ardenweald. Good hunting. The hunt has been called and I have answered. Keep your teeth sharp. For Queen and Grove. Most serious, I'm afraid. Tricks. Lord Harry, well, we than request I. an audience with the Winter Queen.
We stalk the moonless night. Forget that. All that will remain will be empty shells and sorrow. Once again, but in a world not my own. You are reborn in Ardenweal, child of dreams. To this realm are you bound, and you will share its fate. I fear further sacrifices must be made if Revendreth is to survive this crisis. Begging my master's pardon, 
I humbly present the Maw Walker. Ah, the mortal who escaped the inescapable prison. A living soul restoring hope to the realms eternal. Maw Walker, I am aware of your urgent request for Anima. Under normal circumstances, I would of course oblige. Sadly, you arrive in the midst of a violent rebellion. Our resources are stretched perilously thin. This drought has left my people desperate, starving, and some even defiant. But if you were to aid our cause, then I could gratefully provide the aid you seek. Watch. Our voice of the people is doing anything but serving Revendreth. No sacrifice without... As I explained before, sire, we cannot rush such a delicate process. Anima harvesting demands finesse. Our friend grows impatient. Recent events require us to expedite our efforts. See it done, Inerva. But master, I... <laughs> well, what have we here? You really must be more vigilant about uninvited guests, my lady. defiant accuser and her hapless mortal pawn. It is impressive that you discovered our little secret, if a tad inconvenient. You deprive your own people of anima and inflict a drought upon all of the Shadowlands. Why? The other realms would squander our most precious resource. That won't do. Rest assured, this anima will serve a higher purpose. But I fear you will not survive to witness the glory to come. I will deal with them, sire. Harshly. Of course you will. No atonement without sacrifice. Deal with these intruders. I will need some time to secure us a way out of here. By my side. to gain power, more Walker. Let us ascend. Renathal, you came back! How long have we been here? This place is eating my mind! Curator, I'm so glad you have not been broken yet. We need an exit portal. This is the Maw! No one escapes the Maw! We would need a... Maw, Walker. 
This is the curator, one of the greatest archivists in reality. <gasps> uh, more walker? Quickly, I can use them as a conduit. We can ride back along the path they took to get here, but it will only work once. More walker, this will hurt. Please try not to die. Happy to see you. Oh, and I see you managed to get your shirt off. You as well. I could grate carrots on those ribs of yours. <laughs> I send out the call to any who survived. We have quite a gathering collecting here. Renathal. Accuser. Thank you for sending this more walker to find us. Curator. I am fine. I will be fine. Draven, this is more than I could have hoped for. Report. At Theotar's request, we moved what remains of our forces here to Sinfall. There are far less of us than we had in our last assault. Gather the forces. We attack Come closer, so my new I friend. have a plan, but we must act swiftly. Before Denathrius learns of my escape. against the end of reality, we might need some help. your valiant last stand. For so very long, you've punished arrogant souls. But instead of learning from their suffering, you've become one of them. You just need it to obey. How fortunate you are. To witness the splendor of what is about to unfold. Every precious drop of anima, so painstakingly run from the tortured souls of lesser beings, now paves the path for the banished one to reclaim what was his. And once his liberation is secured, it shall be by his will that all washed away. The only power that will emerge from this torrent of change is death. Death and those who shaped its victory. Someone will 
will stop you, Tenathrius. Even if I... Do not speak. Observe. Welcome, my fellow doomed friend. We face the, the unending, surging with his flood of anima. I say nothing will darkness. stop the jailer from breaking free. Denathrius is surely gathering his forces um, inside stop, Castle Nathria. Unchecked, his loyalists will soon overwhelm us. We must rally the Harvesters at Sinfall while this mortal returns to Ouroboros. They must be told what transpired here. I heed the call of the Eternal Ones. How may I serve? The Maw grows, surging with power. How did this come to pass? The evil we believed forever bound has conspired to distract and divide us. The Primus realized the truth, but his warning came too late. I fear he paid a grave price for this knowledge. You speak for Revendreth. Where is your sire? Where is our brother, Denathrius? My sire has betrayed us all. The drought was his doing. He stole the very lifeblood of our realms, starving his own people and yours as well. When his lies were exposed, Denathrius unleashed his vast coffers of anima into the maw to fuel the might of his true master. Long ago, we stood as one to imprison that monster. With the Primus gone and Anaphrius a traitor, our pantheon has been broken and doom comes for the Shadowlands. There is yet hope. This mortal saved me from the Maw and revealed the Sire's treachery. They aided my forest as well. Their kind has shown great potential. If focused, it could turn the tide in our favor. Agreed. For the good of the Shadowlands, each mortal must choose a covenant. And when our realms have regained their strength, we will stand together against the darkness. I will see it done, Eternal Ones. With her voice have I spoken. Come, mortal. The hour of decision is at hand. You wish to be of service? In this moment, we shall follow the path together. Come. Brothers and sisters, hear me. On this day, we have come together for a momentous occasion. The Moorwalker has proven that they are an ally not only to Bastion, 
but to all the Shadowlands. They have chosen to join our vaunted ranks to help us reclaim our realm. Behold our glorious Archon, she who was ancient when this realm was young. Step forward. Face your fellow Kyrian, so they may welcome you as one of their own. This mortal has not been long upon our path. But their strides have echoed throughout the halls of the Ascended. In service to our cause, they have defended our temples against invasion, exposed the traitor to Naprius, and braved the terrors of the Moor itself. On this day, we welcome them into our sacred covenant Together, we will restore peace and order to this realm. Glory to Bastion!